Hey guys, I hope you're doing all fine. Um, I just want to talk to you briefly about how to solder filigree. So, the first thing is what type of solder. Well, I do my own solder, and it's um, basically it's medium solder for the inner filigree wire. I pour it into an ingot like this, then I file it down. I collect the filings. Use a magnet to remove the lamel of the metal from if you'll find any and you'll end up with something like this so it's not clearly just silver filings solder filings then I put them in this tool it's just a cylinder with a small pipe like this filed on the sides and you mix solder and borax inside so this is ready to use to sprinkle onto my piece so what i have here is i'm working on a timbal as you can see i have the first piece ready and i decided to solder it so i put it on a piece of perspex you can put it on a piece of tile or something like that because what you want to do is yeah, we're gonna sprinkle the solder and we'll have extra solder lying there so we'll leave it to dry on the tile and then you can scrape it off and put it back so you don't lose any solder so i put some water there just for the solder to stick so i'm gonna get my, grab my tweezers and i spring in the solder evenly not too much Remember, if you over solder, you have a problem because the solder will gulp up and remove your detail of the on the filigree wire. You don't want that. You just want enough solder for it to be a strong connection, but remain beautiful at the same time. So, that's done. So as you can see, as I said, this is all solder. I'm gonna let it dry, and then I'm gonna scrape it off back in my container. Now, don't be afraid to solder filigree. If you've done a good job when putting back in everything inside, you should have no problem. So a small flame, obviously it depends on the piece. and heat all of it. We are soldering silver here, so silver conducts a lot of heat, unlike gold. So you have to heat the whole piece up for soldering. As you can see, the borax is doing, the borax is doing this work. And now, let me see if I can zoom. There you go. The solder is melting. And that is looking beautiful already. Not too much heat. And now, this is off for the pickle. So I hope this was helpful, if you have any questions just put them in, under the description I'm going to put the recipe for the solder that I use as well. So if you want to do it yourself, um, just be careful obviously of the heat, I mean we're dealing with temperatures of around 1000 degrees Celsius, so <laughs> be careful guys, okay? Enjoy!